Hey YouTube, you're here because you want to reset your TP-Link Google OnHub router. Uh, they, this can be a little bit different, I think, than uh, resetting a Google Wi-Fi router. I know with those, you got to hold down the reset button while you start it. Um, so that's a little bit different than what I think this is. So uh, first things first, take this cover off. You don't really need it. Uh, and then let's look at the back of this here, right? So good view of this all right so see that down here at the bottom that's the power this is the little reset button there it's kind of dark but uh you need something to push in on that with so i'm going to use one of these little uh phone sim card removal tools it's a, it's a little poker you can use a paper clip or a pen or whatever anything that'll fit down there and allow you to suppress it so uh First things first with these, I think you got to power it on. So let's do that. So I'm going to go ahead and plug it in. Now that it's plugged in, we got to wait for the blue lights to, uh, they're probably going to flash a little while and then it'll turn orange because it's, it's trying to connect to the internet with the old settings I had and uh, that's not going to work. So just got to wait it out for a little while. Let that go. Then what I'm hoping is once it realizes it can't connect to the internet, we'll just go ahead and push down on that reset button, hold it down until it uh, shows us something different. I was looking around on YouTube for a video that did this, but I didn't find any, so uh, hopefully this will help other people out if they're having that same problem. All right, we are now flashing amber or yellow or whatever you want to call it. So now I'm going to do my best to go ahead and suppress that and hold it down. Let's hold it down to see if we get any difference in color on the top of the light. Well, nothing's happening now, so maybe when I release, that's what's going to do it. So, oh, there it went. Actually, before I released it, we got a white light, so... Uh, now that I've, I've held it down long enough, it looks like it's doing something to reset. So, yeah, I guess it's a good thing I didn't release because it was about two seconds after I said that, that it, uh, went ahead and re looks like it started the reset process. So now we've got solid blue. I, I'm guessing that means that it's, it's doing the reset. I know that on... On the little white Google Wi-Fi router, solid blue means it's uh, wiping it clean. So uh, I'm bet I'm guessing it's going to be solid blue for a while, and then it'll go ahead and start flashing again once it's ready. So I'm going to go ahead and pause this until that starts to happen. Well, I've been waiting for a little while, and it doesn't seem like it's going to be flashing. So. Um, what I did was I browsed for available Wi-Fi networks just to see if the existing one, or uh, the, the one that it had prior to the reset um, showed up and I do not see it. So I'm thinking that it's, it's actually done, which is actually pretty quick. I know those little white Google Wi-Fi routers, uh, they take a long time to reset. It's actually, on, I think it's up to about five minutes to reset one of those little guys. and. Uh, I don't think that that's the case here. If I do find out otherwise, I'll be sure to edit that into this video. But uh, that's how you reset it. So thank you for watching and have a great day. Well, of course I spoke too soon. It did go from a solid blue light to a flashing blue light, which is what it needs to set up. So um, so that looks like it's what, what you got to do. So the steps are uh, plug it in. Wait for it to go through its little uh, trying to connect phase. Um, once it gives up, uh, if, if, if you're in the same situation as me, that is. But if once, once it's kind of in a stable state, go ahead and suppress that reset button. Hold it down. I think it was about 30 seconds that it took. Um, hold it down for the full 30 seconds. Don't release it until you see the light start flashing a different color. It, I think it went white almost. And it just went white for a few seconds. And then it went solid aqua blue and then after a few minutes maybe like four minutes or so um that aqua blue stopped being solid and started flashing which means it's ready to be set up again so so that's how you do it
Thank you very much.